Today I'm going to play Bass Pro Shops The Strike for the Nintendo Switch. I played this originally when it released on the Xbox 360 back in 2009, and I loved it. I still think that's probably the best fishing game ever. Because it came with a, a fishing rod controller that had force feedback in it. So when you were fighting a fish, it actually fought back. It was amazing. But it was funny because I reviewed this game originally for the 360 for about.com. And I think I got a copy like two weeks ahead of time. Uh, and so I wrote my review and I loved it. I gave it an 8 out of 10, I think. Well, then I read IGN's review because I think they posted theirs a couple days early because, you know, they're IGN. They can do that. And they gave it a 4.5 out of 10. And I'm sitting there like, huh, what is the deal with this game that I loved and they hate? <laughs> Could it be that they were some idiot that had never gone fishing and didn't know what they were doing? That was my guess. This game, when it came out on the 360 and the Wii originally, it wasn't a very good looking game. It was pretty ugly. I think this Switch re-release actually looks quite a bit better. They really seem to have touched up like the water and everything looks nicer. But yeah, this was by far my the what I think is the best fishing game ever. I'm playing there are motion controls on this Switch version, but I'm just using the regular controller. Wow. I got no interest. Ugh. <laughs> There should absolutely be bass in here. Tons of cover. Where are you, you bass turds? See, this is what I would like to fish around. Look at this little inlet thing. There absolutely should be fish here. But the game is all like, no. It's kind of like playing Guitar Hero when you know how to play real guitar. It doesn't ever feel right. Playing, what the? What the? What was that? <laughs> but like, playing Guitar Hero when you know how to play real guitar feels weird. Playing fishing games when you know how to fish for real feels weird, because they never get it right. Oh no! Oh Jesus! Putting up a good fight. Smashing its head into rocks. Wrapping itself around trees. Oh, it's so epic. But see, they fight and fight and fight until their bars run out, and then they're all like, oh, I'm tired. I will just go into your boat. It's still 70 feet away. <laughs> Come on, you turd. Give up. And it's about done. Yay, I caught a decent fish. 39 pounds! <laughs> Holy crap! That was awesome! It, that took 26 minutes! What is this, real fishing? Now it's dark! What the hell is that? Is that an alligator? That's freaking awesome! I've never seen that before. Now I've seen two of them. Oh, you know, there's large mouths over there. Come on, you big mouths. Ah, oh, yeah, now they're all horny for what I'm selling. It's a little one, though. 
At least compared to that giant striped bass I caught. It's a big mouth bass. Oh, uh, yeah, now, it's, now we're cooking with gas. I was going to quit this video and start over. But now, now it's good, except it's nighttime. Boy, they see it from a million miles away. Yeah, it's another small one. Fighting right at the end, though. I'll like two pound, two point five pounds. Like I take it, take that home and cook it. Dang it, fishing is really fun. I've only gone a couple times this year. Wow, that fish was really aggressive. <laughs> it's a little tiny guy. He's really feisty though. <laughs> that was fun. I don't need no tutorial on how to fish. I don't need no instructions to know how to rock. I got a tournament to win this time. The stakes are high. It's not just boring you, the viewer. It's my whole reputation's at stake. But I was saying earlier, I totally forgot, but I had the 360 version of this that I reviewed. And then within the last few years, I bought another copy of it and the controller with the full intention of playing it on a video but that fishing rod controller that's so great and so realistic because it had motors in it that was force feedback they were so loud <laughs> so if i made a video of it the audio would just been like rawr, 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 with the the sound of the motors inside of it and i figured that would be terribly annoying so I had that and then I just never made a video of it because I assumed it would just sound awful. Nice. Here's another, yeah, that's a largemouth. It's not very big though. There's a bigger one that it just flopped right by. It's so far out, but it's so tired already. Three pounds? That's a good fish. I don't know why it uh, was so wimpy. Come on, stupid fish. Don't you know it's good for you? Take you home to mama, she cook you up. Put too much salt on you, but we'll eat it anyway. <laughs> Man, I just burned my mom in this video that she'll never see. 4.7, they keep getting bigger. My reputation keeps improving. Now I won't be that stupid girl with the pink shirt anymore. I'll be the girl that catches all the fish. <laughs> it's fighting so hard right at the end. <laughs> Wow, this fish is awesome. I respect you, fish. A three pound crappie? That's amazing! Yeah, let's proceed to the tournament. Alright, now we're in a tournament. Some dude already has 25 pounds of fish. <gasps> Come on now, Justin, you cheater. You probably caught a striped bass. Come on, fish. I don't have time for this. 2.8 pound bass? Come on. Justin's running away with it. Ugh. Yeah, this is a good sized one. Yeah, 31 pounds. Take that, Justin and Clinton and Jamie. Boy or possibly girl Jamie. This one's big. It's 
Stupid Justin has 68 pounds now. I had a friend named Justin. Now he's a trumper. <laughs> he liked fishing. And racism, apparently. You didn't expect that in a fishing video to air dirty laundry. Thirty-five! Take that, Justin! Yeah, come on! This is a Justin Beater right here. Not a Justin Bieber, a Justin Beater. Those other fish are like, what's wrong with Carl? He's freaking out! <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! That's amazing! That might be the biggest fish I've ever caught in any game ever. I wonder if they want me to drive back to the dock. Because a lot of time in real tournaments you have to be back at the dock at the closing time too. Holy crap, another 50 pounder! I didn't think it was that big. Yeah, I'm ahead by 80 pounds. I think I'm gonna win. I was right! You do have to go back! <laughs> this game was trying to trick me! I got $25! Was that it? I fished all day and hauled in hundreds of pounds of fish for a $25 gift card. That was fun! I caught some big fish. It took a while, but then this episode really kicked off, didn't it? Didn't it? It was exciting! You're excited! This was Eric vs. 365, where I play 365 different fishing games. I mean, I play a different game every day for a year. Be sure to check out psxboxindies.com every day for daily blog posts about the games that we're playing and the videos that we're making. Thanks for watching!